Hi, welcome back. In this video, I am going to show you how to move the rows and columns in an easy way. I have a table here which has got the sales representative and the respective detail. After making the table, I realized I want this name Claude to be moved to some other row. So in order to do that, normally what we do is we look at the desired position, right click and click on insert. Then we just go cut this information and paste it here. This is what normally we tend to do. Now, this is not only going to be a cumbersome process. At the same time, this is going to give us yet another step which we need to look at it. In this video, I'm going to show you a different method which can help us to do that. First, what you can do is when you have decided that you want a particular row to be moved in, just click on that. And when you just bring the cursor around the border, you can see this turns into a four directional arrow or a four headed arrow. Now, what you have to do is just hit the shift key and the left mouse key together. And when you just bring it down, you can see a green line appearing. This is to indicate that the particular row is ready to be replaced at your desired place. Say, for example, now I'm positioning this in between four and five. See what happens there. So at the just at a single click, you will be able to move it. Now you may be asking a question. What happens if you have to move only a range of a cell? Already I have highlighted the entire row here, leaving this. Now what I'm going to do, I'm just going to select only the cells, not the row. In the previous scenario, I just clicked it on the row number three and we have selected the entire row. But whereas in this situation, I'm just going to select only the range of cell and you can place it around the border to see that it turns into a four directional arrow. Hold the shift key and the left mouse key together then when you bring it down, you can see a green arrow line. Just leave it and you can see only the range of the cell have moved, but not the entire row. This is the speciality of doing it. In the same way, you can do it for the column also. Just select the column which you want. Place it around the border and wait till it turns into a four headed arrow. Hold the shift key and the left mouse key together and wait till you get this green line appearing and fix your desired position and just leave it it would have changed your entire column this is going to make your job really simple and if at all you are using office 2016 onwards you don't have to even follow this right click and cut and go to your desired position and click on insert cut cells automatically it's going to do it in the same way for the row also you can do right click cut and place it wherever you want it that's all so both the ways whichever way you are comfortable with you can do it i hope the video was interesting and you have enjoyed the video thanks for joining stay tuned for more such videos this is karpakam signing off good day